Oh, the Baron's attack. Oh God, Artyom. We're still stuck in this desert until we get enough fuel. So while the others are preparing the Aurora for departure, me, Gyul, and Demir must sneak into the oil terminal and steal a railway tank full of fuel. We must open the gate from the inside so that our guys could hook the tank to the rail car and roll it out before any of the Baron's men notice them. Gyul and Amir are going to be waiting for me near the terminal. Hmm. Feels like it's going to be a rough one today. Also, I forgot to open the chat. Oh, there it is. Okay. Hey, Mayuna, welcome to the stream. I'll let you call me get. Um, hmm. So, I was going to jump into that, which I think is the final mission of the Caspian for for well, for the Caspian um but I found out so I started looking into how to get the good ending and it turns out I'm not locked out of the good ending but I could become locked out of the good ending because of my actions in this place and it's not that I've been bad but so to get the good ending you need to have at the end of the game at least two out of three characters that could leave your party and I've already lost one character which is Duke in the Volga so I need to keep my other two characters. And the second character that you can lose is here in the Caspian, and it's Damir. Damir will leave your party if you haven't adequately helped the slaves in the Caspian Sea. If you haven't, then he'll actually stay here with Gyul, I think? And try to basically start a resistance movement for the slaves. So the way to to like keep this from happening is to basically play as good as you can in the Caspian Sea and release as many slaves as possible and I have done the major good parts of the, of the Caspian Sea I've kept Saul alive I've uh, released the slaves in the slave ship even though apparently I missed a few there were a few extras you could have saved if you'd actually gone down into the slave cages and seen afterwards because um, there was a lever we pulled in the slave den and it released a majority of the slaves. But there are apparently ones that are in special cages. And I didn't release the one that, ones in special cages. Because I didn't know they were there. Also on the water mission. There's a slave in a cage. Somewhere that I never saw. And you could release him for good karma too. And I didn't do that. But I, I did all the other stuff. I saved the one slave that was getting attacked in the desert. Even though he killed himself afterwards. So I don't know. Um... It, it's just such a weird because there's no indicator of if your karma is good or not other than like screen flashes at random times so it's like I don't know if I if I went to go do the Baron's mission I actually don't know if if uh, Damir would uh, would actually stay and the only other quest I know I've done is I've done the the outdoor mine where I killed all the slave guards there and apparently that's another one you're supposed to do to help the slaves but the slaves there never ran away I killed all the guards there without hurting any of the slaves, and they just kind of stayed cowering in the desert right outside the, the the slavers' den, whatever it was there. So I'm like, did I not do that right? Because the slaves didn't run away. But as far as I could find online, all you had to do was kill the guards, and I did kill all the guards that were in that place. So I, I'm hoping that one counted towards good karma. But... What I'm thinking of is instead of going to the Caspian Sea, I found out that there is a Sal quest line that you can do here if you kept him alive. But and I've been waiting for that because I knew that there that was a thing. But um, do I have all my ammo? Yeah, I have all the ammo. Um, you apparently have to go to a specific place and sleep. And I think that's. Up there somewhere. Excuse me! God damn it, you again? You can shove me out of the way last time, too. Um. So, first, that's not my van. That's my van. So, first off, we want to go see if we can actually activate that. And I want to say it's in this direction. Because basically, I have to find a brand new safe house and sleep in it to get Saul to show up. But I don't actually know if I'm going to the right one. Oh my god. Is 
Is that it? Okay, so over here, we passed by a place the first time we went across this bridge. That I, I kept saying was a demon. It's where the demon picked me up. But there's a ladder nearby a bridge chunk there. And I thought that just led up to where a demon probably slept. But apparently that might actually be a safe house. Which doesn't seem very safe ne being next to a demon, but you know, we'll see. Oh, that's scary. Oh my god, okay, you're... I... I hit a rock right before the end. God damn it, and it pushed me into the fire. I didn't, they, apparently they start ambushing you halfway or into the section. Huh. For a second, I didn't react because I'm like, is that Saul? Is that fucking Saul? Did he fucking show up? I guess I'd better get out of the car to handle this guy. Okay, let's try that again. <clears throat> I wonder if there's anything in particular that triggers it. Maybe I should like turn off my lights. Will they still see me? Damn, if Saul's quest has me driving around and these guys are gonna start ambushing me, this could be annoying. Just squish out of you guys. Maybe they won't show up this time. Oh, there they are. How are they still hitting me? How are they still hitting me? <laughs> Damn it. I wonder if the... No, I, it should be doable. It's just kind of annoying. I have to say, I wonder if this becomes impassable after after the final quest opens up. Part of me kind of just wants to go do the final quest because I feel like I've done enough for good karma for Demir to come with me. I don't know. I'm afraid, though. I wish this game had multiple save files like almost any other PS4 game because... Then I could just save an extra file and be like, you know what, if Demir leaves, I'll just come back to this file and try the Saul quest. But, it doesn't have that. It's just a single save file game. Why did it send me back here? I auto-saved closer. We'll try that one last time. Listen up, everyone. Prepare to cut off the main. All right. Everyone is. If it doesn't work this time. We might just go to the safe to the final quest. 
Cause I ain't got time for this shit. But I think what I gotta do is if I have to jump off the bridge. I don't know if I'm too high off the ground though for that. Can't roll through because the mods have got just the car on fire. Oh, there's a guy right behind me. So you're the fucker that was shooting me. Oh, great. Oh, they're getting attacked by the... Yeah, they're getting attacked by mutants. Yeah, yeah, there's some animals that are attacking them. So that's helpful. Can't go this way. Oh, there they go. Eat him! Eat him good! Oh, you guys suck. You fucking hit so die. Finally. Now, could I actually get past that? Because the fucking oil isn't. Here, now it's quick save. Well, I should really loot these guys too. And in the meantime, the fire finally died down. Might actually be right around here. The place. One of these places has like a ladder that goes up to it. I remember seeing it on the way here the first time. I can't jump up to this, can I? in the car I'm at a bit of a crossroads I think the bridge pieces continue in this direction there it is So this place, if I go up here...
Yeah, here we go. This is a safe house. So all I should have to do is actually sleep here. What's up here? Okay. Some stuff. Surprise there isn't a workbench here. Also, putting, putting the sniper scope on this gun was actually a really good choice. I'm really into the silent sniper. Wait, can I get in through here? I mean, I can. It doesn't really do anything, does it? Uh, let's drink to our health. And, well, first off, I kind of want to... I don't want to quick load just in case this goes bad. Or quick save. There we go. That is a pretty shot of the distance over there. I'm stuck. There you go. Picture for next stream. Um. Okay. So let's sleep until morning. And if I'm right, and it might not be right, it might not even be the place, but I'm hoping I'm right. Look, he's waking up. Oh, hi! Hey, don't get all tense here. If we wanted you dead, you'd wake up dead already. No two ways about that. Huh? <laughs> Hell yeah! Ooh, don't there's a lot of dudes here. Pal. Sal wants to make you offer, so listen. <laughs> so, here we meet again. Did you forget how you knocked me out back then? I sure remember. My head still hurts, you see? <laughs> I also remember that you didn't kill me when you could. So here you go. Eight bullets in the cylinder, you see. Cost me two tons of water, so be gentle with it. But that was just foreplay. Time for business. I figure you'd want to know why I rushed you then. Eight bullets in the cylinder. Do you know our Baron? Well, I basically had him on a plate already, you see? Hmm. I spent five years sucking up to him and roughing up the damn locals for him. I put the gun away, man. You'd be dead by now had we walked. Oh, sorry, to sorry. Him. Now we're talking. What was I talking about? Aha. Hmm. I spent five years sucking up to him and roughing up the damn locals for him. I even got his custom van for that service. Mm hmm. Ah, don't sweat it. <laughs> you can keep it. I have more than one car. So, to cut to the chase, I almost lost that crazy witch on his ass. She was supposed to whack him, and I had all the preparations in place. Rast, vach, tiri, tamki, you see? 
Talking about Gule? And that's the moment you guys choose to arrive at. Train and all. The Baron, with his paranoia, immediately decides that you are a new gang from the West. How to get him specifically. And all my planning goes to the shitter. Lock all the doors, triple the guards, the whole shebang. That girl lost any chance of getting close enough to him. But now I think this might even be for the better. <laughs> Besides, you just helped that girl out at the lighthouse and freed the slaves from the ship dismantling operation. I Don't did that, worry, yeah. We caught most of them by now. <laughs> but still, that was a good distraction. Now the Baron is sure you're targeting his Oh, you caught too. the slaves? You dick! In any case, I'll be frank. Neither you nor I are interested in Baron staying alive, so I say, whack him for good. You seem to be up to the task. I can still feel the thrashing you gave me. <laughs> Consider the gun and the car in advance payment. If you do take that gun? Out, I'll make sure none of the boys take chasing you too seriously. Then we'll be even. If you fuck up, no skin off my back either. I'll just save the Baron from the evil gang out to get him. And he'll crown me by his own hand. <laughs> so, think about it. You still have time. Okay, well, what do you want me to do, though, exactly? Also, is this gun worth taking? I don't like it better than my gun, but I wanted to pick it up just in case it... Man, I really have a lot of pistol shots, too, and I just never use pistols. Hmm. It's tempting. But, yeah, let's... No! Switch back. And just take the attachments. Okay, so what do you want me to do... You didn't put any quests up. What? What happens if I leave and come back? Where's the exit? Hey, leaving already. No, well, I mean You gonna say something? What do you want me to do? gonna shoot me if I leave? What do you want me to do? Do I take the gun? Yeah, I take the gun. What the fuck? I, I, I don't understand. Wanted you to. Yeah, I fucking know. Now we're talking. What are we talking about? Did I break something? What if I sleep until night? I don't want to leave my gun though. <laughs> I like my gun. Doesn't seem like having this gun helps at all, so I'm gonna take my gun. Put it away though before they shoot me. Uh, sleep till night. Are you that tired? All right, have some rest. We'll chat later. Maybe it's a nighttime quest? And that's why I said, don't worry, you still have time. Mm. Yeah. And they're gone. Okay.
There's nothing new on the map. You guys are only here during the day? Dude, I'm so fucking confused right now. Did he actually even say anything he wanted me to do? No, he's just straight up gone. Not upstairs, are you? No, it doesn't look like it. Hey, what is that crunching sound? I don't like it. Alright, I... I don't know. I don't know what to do with this guy. I think something broke there. I guess. Because I have no quests on my mini-map, so it's like, what, what do you want me to do then? I might just go do the final quest and see what happens. If I get the bad ending, then I just gonna... Gonna have to deal with it, I guess. Because I could restart, I guess and trigger the conversation again? Don't want to do that. Falling into pain shock. Mm. You know, people keep talking about all the good stuff I've done. I feel like... I've done enough that Demir should be okay with coming with me. I hope, anyway. Yeah, let's just go try to do the final quest. I really have no fucking clue what the hell the problem with Saw was. Nothing's showing up now that I'm moving, right? Doesn't seem like it. I'm so torn. I don't know if I should, though. I don't know if it would help too much with my karma. But then I'm like, am I missing stuff out too by not doing his quest line? Where'd that flaming tumbleweed come from? It wasn't there a second ago. Fucking hell with this game. It's an omen. It's an omen that I gotta go back. Let's just do it. Uh, quick load. See if it changes this time around. I'm gonna waste all my time just trying to figure out how to make this quest work.
Okay, in. Sleep till daytime. Tense here. If we wanted you dead, you'd wake up dead already. No two ways about that. Huh? Right, right. <laughs> Hell yeah! So don't you worry, pal. Sal wants to make you offer. So listen. <laughs> right, well, talk to me. So here we meet again. Oh, this is a really long conversation you too. Forget how you knocked me out back then. I sure remember. My head still hurts, you see? <laughs> God, the beeping of my motion detector gets really annoying too. You could. So here you go. Eight bullets in the cylinder, you see. Cost me two tons of water, so be gentle with it. Is he talking about this gun? Time for business. I figure you'd want to know why I rushed you then. He puts his hands out and then he's like, eight bullets you to the city, dude. Well, cost me so much water. I guess it's this already. guy. You see? Hmm. I spent five years sucking up to him and roughing up the damn locals for him. I even got his custom van for that service. Ah, don't sweat it. <laughs> you can keep it. I have more than one car. So, to cut to the chase, I almost lost that crazy witch on his ass. She was supposed to whack him, and I had all the preparations in place. Rast, vach, tiri, tamki, you see? And that's the moment you guys choose to arrive at. Train and all. The Baron, with his paranoia, immediately decides that you are a new gang from the West. How to get him specifically. Mm -hmm. And all my planning goes to the shitter. Lock all the doors, triple the guards, the whole shebang. That girl lost any chance of getting close enough to him. Mm -hmm. But now I think this might even be for the better. <laughs> Besides, you just helped that girl out at the lighthouse and freed the slaves from the ship dismantling operation. Don't worry, we caught most of them by now. <laughs> but still, that was a good distraction. Now the Baron is sure you're targeting his business too. In any case, I'll be frank. Neither you nor I are interested in Baron staying alive, so I say, whack him for good. You seem to be up to the task. I can still feel the thrashing you gave me. <laughs> Consider the gun and the car in advance payment. If you do take Baron out, I'll make sure none of the boys take chasing you too seriously. Then we'll be even. Wow. Oh. If you fuck up, no skin off my back either. I'll just save the Baron from the evil gang out to get him. And he'll crown me by his own hand. <laughs> okay. So, think about it. You still have time. I get... So, it's not a quest line you have. You're just telling me to go do the final quest, aren't you? Because he wants me to take out the Baron and I'm going to the Baron's hideout, I think, right now. Oh, oh, fucking K, okay, then I'll just go take out the Baron. And I guess I'll swap onto this real quick. Take the stuff off of that. Alright, you guys aren't gonna shoot me if I leave, right? Because you guys get, like, into attack position. Let's just quick save here, just in case. Yep. I'm out here. You gotta go kill the Baron. I gotta go punch him in his face. I gotta go beat him up. Oh, also, hold on a second. You guys aren't shoot. Are you? You're not gonna shoot me? Okay. Yeah. No. You, you guys are friendly. Okay. That, this makes a lot more sense. All right. So let's go. Let's go to the final question. Let's just do that. 
That's all there is left to do. I think, I think maybe if I'd come to Saul earlier, he might have told me to go... I think the ship dismantling thing he's talking about, it might actually be the outdoor mine that I was wondering if I'd finished. So he apparently seems to think that um, that it's already been, the, the, I've already released the slaves. I'm guessing if I'd come here first and talk to Saul, he would have told me both to go help Yule and to go to the outdoor mine. Um, and then Anna tells you to go to the slave ship. But I've already done that, so those are probably his quests and I just did them out of order. That makes a lot more sense, I think. Because nothing showed up again, I can't imagine that the game is broken twice. But for just hearing him out this time... I have a really bad case of, like, a kind of getting distracted during the dialogue in this game. So I didn't hear him exactly right before, and I thought that I'd missed something and I had to do something else. And it was a whole mess, but uh, we're on track now. Everything's fine. Everything's great. We're gonna go beat up a Baron. It's gonna be awesome. Problem. Actually, which way are we going? Yeah, this way, right? We're gonna pass through that guarded area again. Hi, friend. Also, another thing I found out, we have incendiary shots, right? And I keep forgetting to use them. And I also don't know whether I needed to use them for anything. They're for the spider quest. The one where we were in the in the base, like, that was filled with spiders. The spiders are flammable. That's why I was using Molotovs on them. But if you just hit them with an incendiary shot, they catch on fire. So that's like the easy strat. You use incendiary shots to get rid of them. I think it's this way. So I'm supposed to rendezvous with uh, Gyul and Demir before I go in, I think. Let's quick save here. Look at this pipeline. Here, where? The Near the tank. Oh, over there. For you. I'm a coming. Huh. Hey. Artyom, we took a look around. The main gate is guarded by a skeleton crew. You cannot go through gate. Go through the prison cellar where the Munai by Lair keep the slaves. Hmm. <laughs> yes. In any case, the plan is this. Gyul and I will try to take their guards down quietly and get in through the gate. If quiet does not work out, we will at least distract them while you get in through the underground. Okay. Let's go. We'll, we'll walk with you. Alright. Don't lag behind. I'm not. God. I'm actually in front of you. Ask. Uh -huh. If possible, don't kill the slaves. No, I'm gonna kill everybody. They're not. They just obey the Manai by Lair. Obey the Baron. They're afraid, that's all. Okay, so here's the hard part. You can't kill the slaves, but I think they have slave guards. And you have to either not fight them or knock them out before they see you. Because if you get into a gunfight, there's nothing you can do. Oh, look, a bunny! And all have been under brainwashing for ages. So we probably should take pity on them. So a great? God, take pity on them. Let's do this. All right, I'll raise it and you get through. All right. I should still have a, enough ammo for this, and I don't think I used any med kits. Great. 
see you up there. All right. And give me a second. I'm gonna make some of this ammo. Let's go down here. Bless blood, Artyom. Please. Sure, sure, whatever. Uh, where's my lighter? I cannot figure out. Oh, there it is. Oh, I see what I'm doing. You alive? I'm guessing not. Put on my night vision. I'm not gonna keep it on right now. Okay, so I can't go through here. Take like the mutants try to get through here at one point. No use. Nobody go. Nobody fool. We stand here all day here. You suck. Better go hunt, find some food, make sled, more use that way. Okay, can't kill these guys. You might be coming back here. Yeah. All right. Let's wait for him to come over here, and then we'll kill him in this hallway. You won't be able to see me in the dark, right? He doesn't have a headlamp. I'll wait until he turns around, just in case. Come on. Turn around, big boy. Nothing. Try to make me jumpy. You gonna turn around? Who is that? I need check, I think. There we go. Nice and easy. Charge this up. can't knock him out now okay quick load he apparently heard me turn out the fire oh my god he heard me turn out the fire and he's like what the fuck is that and then the entire time he's getting up Artyom just watches him I can't freaking knock him out Ugh. this fucking game is so clunky also how do we put out those fires anyway all you hear is like a whooshing sound. Like, why are you just blowing it out really intensely right behind these guys? I bring a bottle of water and pour it on it or something? What the fuck is happening? Okay, I'm glad that works. It wouldn't give me the, the thing to knock him out, so I just punched him. Guess I have to go upstairs, right? I hear panting. Is there a dog? Oh, but I'm not back. Have a good day. Okay, no worries. I'm glad you came, though. Don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. What? We're all dead. We're all dead now. Amy is here now. 
Okay, hold on. Who the fuck? So there's a slave on the ground. I guess I have to sneak past him. Because he wasn't even looking. There's a say below. He's not even a, a, the type to attack, but he's uh, he starts freaking out if I kill the one above him. So many guys. There's a lot of people here. Oh, you snuck by that scene because it seems like that's doable. I kept thinking I had to knock out a bunch of guys, but it looks like I can just. Also, welcome to the stream, Jacko. Glad to see you again. Oh, God. Don't look at me, I'm not even here. Shit, those people sleeping everywhere. They're dog fighting, what assholes. Alright, you. You keep sleeping on. Okay, I think it's going well. Let me recharge my, my thing again. Emir. Oh yes, quick save, please. Aurora is ready to set out. What's your situation? Over. Oh, there was more not awful, I guess. We're inside the compound, but you went missing. Wait for our signal. Over. Copy that. You went missing. There you go, thank you! Yeah. It's not so hard when I'm not an idiot about it. Shit. Oh god. Uh, well, I guess I. Well, no, I guess I still stealth. Oh, hi! Look, the tank is full. Just what we need. So how do we get it out of here? There is also bad news. The gate is locked and we can't take it out. Colonel, sir, Damir here. We have secured the tank, but encountered uh, a problem with the gate. Copy that. We're going with plan B then. Act accordingly. See, the cable connects the gate and the top of the tower. How do we get there, though? Oh, it looks 
to the top of the tower? Gentlemen, surely you're not seriously intending to attack our fortress. I do respect your courage, but simply throwing your lives away such a waste. Mm -hmm. Who is in charge between you two? Come up here. We have things to discuss. Oh, am I being invited? A complete about face. And we did throw a wretched into his plans big time. Put the gun down and come up. Otherwise, we'll have a pointless bloodbath on our hands. Oh, he's just inviting me to the tea party. Oh, that's so nice. I don't gotta shoot my way in? I guess I'm gonna have to shoot my way in. The game glitched here for me. I had to redo. Oh, dude, that sucks. This game has a lot of little clunky, glitchy issues. It kind of sucks. Hopefully, they just fix those with patches soon. Looks like it's working for me, though. I guess. Okay. Then let our guest in. Huh? Where did you go? I am up on the tower already. I have a plan. Oh, nice. Okay, we got an inside person. Oh. Hello, I'm here for Come the tea party. On. We won't even touch you. Unless you really ask for it. I don't like this, but there is no other way. If we don't get down to the desert, we would Apparently there's a slave here you can save for good karma, but if you save him, things get a lot hotter than they would otherwise. Oh. Oh, hello. I thought it, I thought I was on the wrong side. Why the fuck does it take so long? You could do it with your eyes closed. I know that. Will you stop bugging me? I'm making something for the boss here. Ha! You must be one of the dream gang. Yeah, I might be. Just you take a fucking look at the beauty Vince is making for the boss. It's not just any old sort of wheels, I tell you. We start it here. Oh, that... That really sucks. I hate when games do that. Put your back into it! Why the fuck did we feed you yesterday? Oh! That one should got fired over his stupidity! So once he goes in here, I will not. No kill, Master Misa. No kill, clicks, Master Angus. Okay, that was a blue flash, right? The screen flash blue. If you kill him outside, everybody sees you, and they get mad. Well, yeah, I didn't kill him. I just knocked him out. But who can have a drink? Up that ladder. Let's quick save there just in case. Dude, it's like it's a whole little fucking town up here. so bad, but I don't want to start a gunfight here. Oh! Shit, what happens if I save her? Is she already dead? No, I think he's just taking her over here. Am I in the right place? 
Okay. Oh! You seem to be missing some articles of clothing. I'm sure you won't. Hello. You're the one to see the boss? Yeah. Come on in. Okay. Don't waste boss time here. Oh, I, I, I thought they were going to open the door for me. Oh, well, look, it's the same girl I just talked to. And her third twin right over there. Did you just take my equipment? You find it weird they're not really bothered by your little mischief. Well, you see, mm, this jiggly. world is a harsh and chaotic one. Don't touch me. I'm just doing my best to introduce a little order into it. Without which, there is no hope for something better in the future. But with no hope, you can't live. But let us cut to the chase. You definitely did not come here to enjoy the scenery. Ergo, you have a goal. And that goal is probably far from here. With yeah, this is still my first so playthrough. I'm, ready to provide you with I'm trying to do my best to get the good ending. I'm not asking for much in return. Surrender Gyor to me. Oh, Bring no. Me, what? And we all win. Ah. Gyor, you will have your fuel. Well, I'll take some coffee, though. Everyone gets to live long. Fuck yeah, give me that black bean juice. Oh, thank you. Yes, finish him. Thank you. Oh, Q, you're such a badass. Okay, here's where things get rough, though. Okay, so apparently there's... From the other side, that coward. Do you think I'm a fool? You didn't want to see Now you will all die. Starting with you, Q. Killed it. Nice, some Molotovs and stuff. Yeah, there's some Molotovs and stuff right here. Shit, where are they coming from? They went through the door! It fucking went through the door, what the fuck? Eh, nothing, don't worry about weak, it. And you value the weak. But the world lives by different rules. The strong ones always win. Gotcha. It is through this fact that we protect them, direct them, keep them from disappearing in this desert. Yeah, I might have messed up the good ending. It, it seems like it's really annoying to get the good ending in this game, honestly. I'm not completely sure I haven't messed it up yet. I need to see if Damir stays with me here. Motherfucker, come on out. Is that not a dude? I'll catch him and open the door for you. Okay. Hold on. Hurry it up, because I think that's a juggernaut. Fuck. Where are you going, you windbag? Bite a bullet! Be 
your fucking head. He shot me through the bucket! The asshole! I don't like how things aren't solid sometimes. Notice how the first volley of his shots didn't do any damage to me, though, but that second one just randomly went right through the bucket. Or barrel, whatever the fuck it is. Yeah, they really suck. Is this before I've picked up everything? No. Where are you going, you windbag? There you are! Bite the bullet! Oh, they've molotov me! God damn it! <coughs> <coughs> Fucking course. Ugh. <sighs> Let's throw Molotov as soon as he comes in. Got him once right there. Where are you going, you windbag? There you are. Oh, I killed him! No, I didn't kill him. Did I kill him? I did kill him! No, please! No, please! Okay, didn't get me. Switch to my shotgun. Never mind, don't switch to the shotgun. Shit, they're coming around the side over there. at all they're everywhere I need to clear out one side of them like really fast I should have stayed here because they were the guy that was around was like way off in the distance the Molotov by the doorway works though if I can just full him because he can't if I put the Molotov right by the doorway he uh, apparently he has to come in and then he just kind of stays on the fire until he dies Same happened to me. Yeah, this, this actually freaking sucks. Open the door for you. Hold on. Let's get him through the window. Some free damage right there. Where are you going, you windbag? <laughs> Okay, he's done. Are you... Oh. 
Apparently I'm just really low health right after I take out the Juggernaut. I need to heal immediately. I saw that I needed a med kit. I thought I had enough time to throw a Molotov before I died. At least the, the, this guy isn't too hard now, though. Where are you going, you windbag? Okay. Let's go this way. Got you. Take him out of the, take a thing. I took out the guys up top. I see you over there. Can I? No, I can't quick save here. Gotcha. Ugh! No, run, 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 run! Actually, run over here. Get this, you fucking bitch! Is that another Molotov? Another... Heavy gunner? Oh, Demir, fucking... Thank God it's you. Uh-oh. What was that? Whoa. Oh, impressive. So, this is the plan Gule was talking about. What the hell is going on there? Get out of there. I'll send people to cover your retreat. Oh, thank God. There's ammo everywhere. I should have switched to my multi barrel. Come on, Artyom. Okay, hold on one second. Uh, let me let me change my gun barrel on my thing. I know I, I shouldn't probably be doing this, but I don't think the game is gonna freak out on me. I need the quad shot. And reload it, please. Yes. I only have two health packs left. Oh, actually, can I make a health pack? What do those two? There's a safe here too? Alright, let me... Oh, I already got the safe. Yeah, yeah. And I th think the only guys that didn't loot are the ones up there? Which I don't think I can get to. What happened to you, friend? Okay, I'll loot you. Oh, okay, bye. <laughs> oh god, this game's so broken. Can I get up here? There's a guy right there. Yes, loot him. Loot the unlootable. Okay, I can't get that guy. I don't think you're allowed to go up there. Alright, okay, let's go Let's go help Demir now. Should I use a health pack? I don't know what's happening next. What the hell? 
Take the baron. Where is he? Oh! Oh, my face! I thought he fell. Artyom, your head's in the way. Oh! Ooh, Anna. Oh, I love Anna so much. You gave my people hope. I'll never forget it. But this war has only started for me, and I must see it to the end. The winning end. Demir, please don't go with her. <sighs> Let's go, Arthur. Oh, thank God! Thank you for helping my people. I'm in your debt forever. <laughs> oh, thank God. You're back, my love. I was so worried. Yes, he came with me. Yes, okay. So that I need, I needed Demir to come with me right there, if I wanted to still be on track for the good ending. Trophy earned, Demir. Yeah, because if I didn't save enough of his people, he would have left with Gyul to help, uh, to help her save her people. Cannibals in the mountain bunker. Slavers on the shores of the dried out sea. Oh, thank God. How many monsters has the war given rise to? Or perhaps were they always there? And the war simply gave them a chance to show themselves and now we're stuck with them forever. Regardless, we can't afford to lose hope. We are getting ever closer to our dream. Finding a place where we could live, free from radiation and mutants. The maps we recovered in the desert have provided us with several promising options. And now the crew members are excitedly waiting for the colonel's decision on where the Aurora should go next. Currently, though, the train is calmly rolling eastward. The crew rests, and Stepan proposed to Katya. Aww. It was a proposal she couldn't refuse. Well, don't say it like that. That's kind of... <laughs> makes it sound bad. Is, is this supposed to be white screen the song? Oh! Oh, she's naked. <laughs> Damn coughing. You really you shouldn't be smoking with that cough. Ago, and it still persists. <laughs> what does Crest even smoke? <laughs> it's terrible. In any case, I'm better now. I don't know about that. I the rough guys, but uh, you should come to the mess hall. The table is almost served. Thanks, Stepan. We'll be there in a moment. Shall we go, hmm. Artyom? Perky. Or shall we stay a little longer? It's so nice. I wouldn't mind staying a little longer. You know, Artyom. I've been looking at Stepan and Katya, you and me, and thinking how lucky we are. Plus, you couldn't refuse, so right? <laughs> with my parents. It was bad. Did I ever tell you why my mom died? Of course I didn't. It was because of Dad. He used to be even harsher back then. He used to come home from the barracks and reach for the bottle while taking off his boots. They'd quarrel, and then he'd stop appearing for a time. And while he was away, she'd start drinking too, and crying when she was sober. She'd feel better, would get kind of dreamy when drunk. You know how she used to call me, just A. She'd hug me and say, one day, A, you and I are going to go to Vladivostok, the city I was born in. And from there, to a village on the ocean shore. I was five back then and didn't really get much. I figure it's just but because they're stuck on a train together. Marriage. She's probably the like, yeah, I guess so. It's not like there are any because other men around here that are single. And she probably would have chosen Artyom if, if he was sick. Drank some kind of poison. <laughs> just Father drank quit poison. drinking after mom's death. Didn't ever pay much attention to me, but with her gone, he'd never leave me alone. Took me along everywhere. We only talked about her a couple of times, though. Huh. 
I used to have this doll, Jana. I played make believe that she was my daughter, and we went to the ocean together. got her a together. drink. Then my father hid it, told me it got lost. He probably didn't want me to agonize over mom's dream. Then I imagine she grew up and went to Vladivostok. And now I'm going, not to Vladivostok, but with you. The dream came true. By the Aww. way, I was always intrigued by what dad dreams about. He should have some dreams, so what are they? Higher rank? Yeah, maybe he made her a ring out of a tin cat. Save Hope he people. fancy. What would the saved do next? Sit underground? I never understood him. What does he hope for in life? What makes him happy? Nothing, perhaps. He never really had any time to think about tomorrow. Down in the metro, those thoughts don't come casually. Here on the surface, though. Mm. I, for one, have something I want to do. I want to run through the sand barefoot. Build a sand castle for the kids. I'm imagining two. A boy and a girl. Oh, God. Would be a copy of you. We go <laughs> a copy. The mountains behind us. Wooden houses on the shore. The sun would wake us up every day, rising from the ocean. That harbor is our destination. Worth going there, even if we have half the world to cross. Everyone should have a destination. A point on the map where they aspire to go. And where one her skin looks kind of weird. Happy. All our guys have their own. Duke used to have one. That's they true. Broke out of the metro and are now starting to scatter. Not at once, of course. At first, we're all still. Yeah, that was a, well, that was technically my fault, but Duke. <laughs> leaving. Each of us will find a point like this, and stay there. I don't know where my dad's destination is. Don't know where yours is either. But I know I love you a whole lot. It really makes me wish that Artyom could fucking talk. Especially in situations like this. I guess I'll smoke just in case it triggers something. That was cute though. So she wants kids. Yeah, just blow it in her face. <laughs> Okay, I guess we better go. Go, Artyom. I'll rest some more and join you later. Okay. You have fun then. Let's go see what. Oh, hi. Everything is perfect, Artyom. Follow us. Okay, well, I want to check out what's going on back here first. Who's that? Oh, that's nobody. Don't need none of that. Don't need none of this. Oh, this is cool. Oh, look at that. We're in the suburbs. Oh, it's so nice. Oh, it's so nice. Oh, this is the fuel tanker. Damn, this thing was full. I wonder how far that'll get us. What is this? Dude, you brought the car! Aw, oh, dude. Aw, oh, dude. We got such a nice setup. Aw, oh, dude. They have a whole fucking garage for it, too. Chris, I'm running to you a note because I really wouldn't want anyone to overhear. Uh, you see, I'm preparing a wedding surprise for Cotty and step on, and I need your help. I'm making rings for them. Oh, look, they did make the rings out of tin cans. <laughs> and I already have the band to make them out of. I just need their sizes. Step on's not a problem after all. I made gloves for all the crew. But I never measured Katya's fingers. And it would be a dead giveaway if I wanted to do it now. I know you have a sharp eye, so perhaps you could help me out and size the right without measuring. I could also use some help buffing the rings once they're sol soldered. And all, and as there's not much time left. Thanks in advance, TT. Huh. Oh, that's cute. That's so cute. Oh, these people are fucking cute. Well, where'd the suburbs go? Damn, looks like bombs dropped here. How much of the countryside can go by if I just had waited here? 
How much did they make? I don't want to wait to find out. It probably loops after a while, I'm guessing. Oh, look at this. Sure, I'm going, I'm going. Oh, look at him. What did I miss? You should have seen them dance. Don't you worry. You'll get another chance. A moment of your attention, please. Hey, you got a beard. Half a year on the road, and 4,000 clicks behind us. We have been through a lot. Duke. What you? I'm sorry, don't look at me like that. I do understand. I can't keep it Duke, secret much longer. The one that already am killed. Careful study of the satellite maps we've obtained and much deliberation. We found a place we could call our new home. It is a river valley. There's forest and a hydroelectric power plant. Yeah. This place is quite far from densely populated areas, which, as our journey has proven, is important. We're about two days away from it now. So, congratulations! Yeah. 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 Should we congratulate each other before we even get there? This is not our last order of business for today. Step on. Katya. Yeah, I like to explore because the train changes every time you come on it. Repeat after me. I take you to be my spouse. I take you to be my spouse. And vow to hold you from this day forward. And vow to for hold better you from this day forward. For, for, for better or for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness, in sickness and, and in health. To love and to cherish to until to cherish death do us part. Fuck, they just know it. <laughs> oh, wait a second. As the captain of this ship, I hereby pronounce you husband and wife. Live long and be happy. Oh, and go for it! Anna? Oh my god, she's bleeding. Yeah, I mean, I fucking knew that cough was gonna become something. Oh no. You're not fine. Shit. What are we gonna do about this? I Blood's don't all over the table. About this. The old man is furious. He's not furious. Getting chewed out today. What? It's what did I do? Fault. I fell into that stupid bunker all by myself. And if Dad says one word to him about it, I'll tear him a new one. Yes, this is getting old. As soon as something happens, it's always Artyom's fault, even when he had nothing to do with it. Yeah, exactly! <laughs> Honestly! Yes. <laughs> That's just his lot in life. You shouldn't worry either, Anna. She'll fix you in no time at all. She's good. No doubt about that. <laughs> do you get you the Teddy Bear and Guitar? I did! I did! I got them both! That's it, Fat. 
Thank you, Anna. I don't think I saw like her actually playing with the teddy bear. I did play the guitar with uh, Stepan though. But I did get the teddy bear. She's better already anyway. Go! Your man is waiting. No, I don't wanna. Oh, you cleaned the blood off your face. I don't wanna. Also, my hands are super pa What the fuck? Guys, I think I might be dead too. What the fuck? Don't worry, Artyom. We won't be drinking without you. Go just gonna, to just gonna teabag her. <laughs> Dude, my, I'm so fucking pale. I'm pretty sure I'm actually already dead, guys. Like, yeah, they should they should worry about fixing me up, because I'm literally dead. Look at how pale I am. Ugh. Alright, what's going on over here? So, son, care to tell me what do we do now? Well, how the fuck am I supposed to know? So, Katya, what do you think? I think that trusting some degenerate's diagnosis wouldn't be wise. A move from humid metro into the desert with its dry heat and sandstorms is a stress for us. Yes, life. I do think she'd be hit really bad right off the start had it my been gas. My thoughts exactly. Thus, first I'll check her condition to the best of my knowledge. Also, we're approaching the valley with its forest air. That alone could heal her. I'm sorry to That's really bad. optimistic. It's the sand. Sounds more like TB to me. Oh this god. We can handle. We've got enough antibiotics, and air does help with that. We have antibiotics for TB? What if that degenerate was right, Katya? What do we do? Is there a medicine? There was an air defense battery station in our village. Right on the brink of war, they received a new drug. It saved a lot of people after gas exposure and general poisoning. I'll check my mom's records and find its name. I think it was produced in Novosibirsk. <coughs> right, Novosibirsk. Yermak, your opinion. For Anna's sake, I'd go to the edges of the earth. As for Novosibirsk, it's about 2,000 clicks. Then it's decided. We head for the valley. If it is suitable, we settle there. If our state worsens, I'll take a group of volunteers to find that drug. Hmm. So, Katya, please. Find okay, so the next area isn't the last area, then. Don't worry. One more thing, Artyom. I want no surprises in that valley. You are our most seasoned scout. So take the rail car, one volunteer. Go check everything. Wait, what are you wearing? Super industrial apocalyptic? Yeah, no. <laughs> I'm so freaking pale. No, I'm pretty sure I'm just dead. I have no blood, and that's why I'm pale. Also, my fingers are so disgusting. God, they're like weird, veiny sausages. <laughs> he can teabag. Bum, bum, bum. Maybe it's because he wears. Maybe it's just his hands. Maybe it's because he wears gloves all the time, so he just doesn't get any sun on his hands. <laughs> oh. What's going on over here? So we can go and find it for you if it is need. I'm gonna sit down here for a second. That sounds like a great plan. I'd also like to say this. Guys, please don't worry. I've been feeling pretty bad as it is for ruining the party. Oh come on, you didn't ruin anything. I just brought myself down to rock bottom over that bastard from Yamantau. Though it must just be the sand and desert climate. Of course that must be it. We were discussing exactly that just now. All right, a toast to you guys. Just a toast again, I guess. Stefan, will you play that song about us? It is my great. Oh, I think that the good and bad endings also tie into Anna. So I'm really hoping I can get the good ending. As far as I know, I'm on track because Demir is here. Where's Demir? Demir! I saw him earlier. He's somewhere around here. 
Um, but all I have to do is not kill anybody apparently in the taiga because apparently almost everybody is a good person in the taiga even though they'll attack you. I think there are some bandits you can kill but are like all the forest people you're not supposed to kill. And depending on that goes either someone joins or somebody doesn't leave the crew after the taiga. So I don't, I don't know but I have to whoever that person is I need them in the crew after we get out of the taiga. And if I can manage that, then uh, we'll be in line for the good end. <laughs> yeah, okay. God, Russian singing is kind of crazy. Oh, the, the other guitar's right there. Why won't it let me play it? Oh, it's right there. I kind of want to get up to see if I can interact with it. But I'm afraid to end this. Will, will this end it? Oh, I won't play the guitar. Where is Demir? You guys wait for the song to end. No, I can't sit back down! What? I won't sit back down though. I just crouch right here in front of everybody. Oh, there we go. No, I can't, unfortunately. I think I'm just gonna see all the dialogue I can on the train, and I'm gonna end it there, because I have to go to work in... I'm gonna have about an hour, but I'd rather just, since it's Friday, I'm gonna go ahead and leave it for today. And tomorrow, tomorrow night, because I don't work tomorrow night, I'll probably do like a very long stream, and maybe we'll be able to get through the entire next section in one go. No, don't think you can play it. Oh yeah, no. I could play a little bit of it, but I think I think it's just better if I leave it for tomorrow and then like, because I might be able to just stream for like three, four hours and maybe I'll be able to get through the entire next area. So I figure that might be a nice way to do it. So if you want to see me do the next area, I'll probably be playing tomorrow sometime sometime uh, after four o'clock in the afternoon no my oh the guitar oh yeah yeah no I don't think I can I guess ah, got him in fact we're planning to present Nastya with a little brother if she doesn't object. I'd rather get a sister. We could play with dolls. Oh. I could care for her. You could play Sparta in special operations with the brother. Ah, cut it out. <laughs> God knows we've had enough of operations. Working tomorrow, but we'll try. Oh, okay. Well, I hope you can make it, and if you can't, that's totally fine too. And if you're really interested in seeing me mess up a lot when I do play it, the, the, the VOD will be on my channel too, for when you are free. But, um, I don't know, we'll see what happens. He did. Got him. Won't even think about children, but I would sure like to see grandchildren at my age. She's only 20? Yeah, you teach them CQC. Dual wielding pistols. <laughs> <laughs> Dual wielding pistols. Dude, Miller would be such a cool fucking grandpa. 9.45 a.m. here. Oh. Yeah, see, I'm on Eastern time, so over here it's 12.43. She's beautiful, sporting. Yeah, 
an Olympic level with a rifle. I get not having kids in metro. Darkness, TV, rats, mutations. But what about here? <laughs> All right, Dad. We'll get to work on solving your problem tonight. Well, don't tell him. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll make you a bunch of children tonight, Dad. Look at Katia. She's like, what the fuck is happening? Go! Oh, toast to that! I forgot to toast for the first one. Is she gonna think I'm not gonna want kids? <laughs> Leosha. Leosha, I never doubted you. <laughs> yes, Alyosha. I don't think you should be worried about that. If we are successful, there will be people joining us. Honest, good people. I'm sure they survive too. Well, if any bad people decide to show up, they'll be sorry they did. <laughs> One of chapters interesting once and more. I bet it is. I, this game has been pretty interesting overall. We might think of something to do. It's mostly the controls I have That's any true. kind of complaint with, but like story-wise, I've been into it. Oh my God, you people love to drink, don't you? I like how my cup just immediately refills every time I put it down. It's never any more empty than when I put it down before. What? What do I do? I can't even talk. This heat is just unbearable, I must say. Is that it? Yeah, I guess everybody's even. All right, let's take one more look around the train in case anybody else wants to chat. <laughs> I'm still crouching. Oh, bye, bye. Oh, excuse me. Excusez-moi, where the fuck is Demir? He better actually be on this train. I need to protect him with my life so I can still get the good ending. Oh, got all lost there. I like how we're the only ones that get like a full bedroom. Like these guys just get... Oh, never mind, they have like bunks. Alright, never mind. Oh, it's Okarov. Anything happening back here? Oh! Hey! Was like my Xmas work party? Turn my head, wine glass full again? <laughs> that sounds like a good party to me! Magically refilling glasses. Besides, there's finally something nice in here. The river, a forest, even a hydroelectric dam. <laughs> that sounds interesting, but I haven't fixed one yet. So don't worry, I tell you, everything will be fine. Soon we'll have a chance at normal lives at that very, you know? Yeah, and hopefully. I don't think so, though. It's about time, Bratuka. Moscow doesn't sound right for those with radiation and all, but the valley, oh, that's the place. And Stepan and Katya would follow suit too, since they're married. Huh. Huh. We do have to True. The colony, you know. we got the good one too, with oh, what is with everybody trying to make me have kids? Smart people. Did anybody stop to think that I don't want to deal with the little bastards? God damn it. And if some assholes decide to crash the party, ho, ho, ho. we'll send them packing in no time with our guys. True. Of course, that valley needs checking out first. The colonel is absolutely right. But you oh, I'm taking Alyosha with me on this one. I bet that means that Alyosha is the one that I have to protect. Boy, that cursed mountain? Oh, I had this nasty feeling that... Oh, that's so pretty. Look at those ruins. He was so eager to see that minister of his. He didn't care. Not quite like him, huh? You imagine if we hit a bump in the road and the van's door just like smacks him in the back of the head? Makes you forget about everything else. This got shot like a dog and serves him right. 
Remember how we rushed to fight the Baron? That one was a real bastard, of course. Treating people like that over nothing, yeah, just as bad as that Strahan gang. Tasty got shot like a dog and serves him right. True, true. I wonder what Saul did about the Baron. You know what? I'm sure Gil will handle him just fine. She's not a girl to do the job half done, huh? <laughs> so what I'm saying is we weren't roasting in that oven for nothing, huh? We also helped people besides getting those mats. Yeah, it's nice I we got to help some people. I think I'll finish with your trophy here. Makes me want to redo this chapter. Did you not do all the stuff in this chapter? Nah, don't worry about it. I'll find him a girlfriend out there in the woods, the tribal people. This van? God, you guys jerry rigged a really cool cart. Never mind the looks, her engine has been finely tuned and maintained. She's got a strengthened frame and springs, even her brakes are in perfect order. The mechanic skill and passion are as plain as day here, and I love that. I really, this thing reminds me this of the account is reinforced. The one I once drove out of Kadu. I miss looking through the slave ship and watching some cutscenes. Oh, I got you. I, I kind of... I kind of just... I, I didn't really know what the slave ship was. I just got it marked on the map by Anna. And I always like to go to all the marked places because a lot of them give you, like, uh, cool equipment and stuff. So I like to go in there to try to get it and see what they, what they have. And I just happen to release all the slaves by accident which I guess was good because it got me the good ending we're in that area so it's definitely good man there's a lot of dialogue in this it takes a lot of experience, like heating up a proper sauna, you know? So, I'd spend half a day getting ready, a couple of hours driving. Yeah. Fell in love with that thing. Oi, Mamachka. No wonder after all that effort. Still, I have to give it to one bastard in Astra, right? Otherwise, I would have just been killed right there, and that's if I got lucky. No, that sucks. Imagine rebuilding a car and having to give it away. As for this beauty, I'll take good care of her. For all time's sake, she'll be winning every car show we run across, huh? That's too bad we can't do something about those rusty chassis. Like a bride on her wedding day. Perfect. So, there you have it, Bratuha. What's up, Bratuha? They're like brother. Okay, cool. I guess we're done. I, I did see that too, that you can miss some things and still get the good ending. I'm just so paranoid, especially now that I've lost Duke, I'm so paranoid about being perfect so that I can make sure I get it. Make sure I get it for sure. Did you take the wheels off my ride? Why has my ride not got wheels? How could you do this to her? All right. Well, you take care of the, you take care of the car. But gotta be right, right stuff. Mi but gotta be right stuff missed. Right, right, right. Cause there's, there's certain things I think you can't miss. Or you, well, you, I don't know. It's hard to tell. I I really wish that um that this game. I don't know if you played Red Dead Redemption Two. I wish this game had a karma bar, like in Red Dead. Like, Red Dead has a karma bar, because there's a good and bad ending in that game, too. And the entire time in the game, you know exactly if you're on the path for the good ending or the bad ending. Because you have a karma bar that'll go up and down depending on what you do during gameplay. 
And I wish this game had something like that. It would make things a lot easier. Oh, you guys are still... You're playing. Sure, sure, sure. Why not? Why not? Hey there, Anna. Oh, I can jam! Oh no, I should have pat her first. I gotta pat her on the arm. Oh. Did I just cut into his song too? He was playing and I'm just like, no, I'm gonna play. And then he just stopped. I thought we were gonna play together. This is a depressing song to choose. Oh, it's pretty though. I do like it. Uh, yeah, I did Red Dead Redemption 2. Oh, dude, I love that game. I, I was streaming that up until... I think somewhere in January is where I finished it. God, I love that game. That was a great game. I'll probably, I'll probably play that game again later this year. Just because... I, I, I actually missed a lot of the qu side quests in Red Dead Redemption 2 because I didn't think they were as cool as they were until the end. On fighting bosses in this game. Wait, are you saying there is a... Or no, you're saying that, that you wish there was a damage bar? It would be nice. I, I like damage bars in general. If anything, I just kind of wish... I feel like the Juggernaut shouldn't take quite as much damage as they do. I don't know. Because I feel like a lot of games that do damage bars also try to make their enemies like really fucking hard and like long to kill. The kinds where you have to like chip away at them. So I don't know about that. I'm kind of sad that it feels like I am getting close to the end of this game though. At least soon we'll have uh, I'm going to get One Piece World Seeker to play. And I'll probably also get Sekiro to play on stream. Those are probably going to be the next games I do. Yo, I like this jam he's doing. It's picking up now. It's getting energetic. I feel like One Piece World Seeker isn't going to be that good of a game, but I'm a big One Piece fan. And I'm hoping it will be. I keep seeing new videos coming out. Oh, thank you. Step on, play some more. <laughs> that was beautiful. Now shut up so Stepan can play. Oh. Oh my god, I'm so pasty and gross. I love that, oh my god, his stomach was coming through the guitar there for a second. It's right there, you see it! Look! <laughs> That's not right. That's not how guitars work. Aww. She's like, okay, stop being weird. Let me go. <laughs> Dude, he has a cool voice. What you staring at? What you staring at? I'm waiting for Days Gone coming next month. You know, I haven't looked into that game at all. Is that one multiplayer? I'd be interested in playing it. I might play it with Pangan if, if, uh, if it is multiplayer. Well, it depends on what time it comes out next month, too. Cause buying two games this month, I need to be careful with my expenses. But I'm going to redo the... That'll be your third replay, won't it? Didn't you tell me you were already redoing it for the good ending? God, Russian sounds like somebody playing a cassette backwards. It's so weird. What, you want a hug? I'll hug you. I'll hug you so good. <laughs> I can't believe she's 20. I, I I thought she was like maybe 27, 28. Not, like she's not old, but 20? She's younger than I am. She does not look it. Multi beam bounty now. Huh. I don't know, I, I need to look more into it because I don't really know anything about days gone by. I'm hoping Sekiro is good though. I was very on the fence on getting it because it's 
made by the Dark Souls guys, and I really like Dark Souls. But, um, the gameplay looks really fucking fun. Like, the grappling hook and everything in it. So I'm kind of into it. No, I'm just gonna play through for now. I got you, I got you. I, unless I get the bad ending, I don't think I feel too much of a need to replay this. It is definitely a good game, but we'll see. If I get the bad ending, I might have to. God, I hate getting the bad ending in games. <laughs> hey, nice finish, man. Okay. Could you play some more, Stepan? Yeah, go for it. Okay, I think last thing to check is up here if there's anything new going on. I have no fucking clue where Demure is, and it's kind of freaking me out. He better not have left the train. Oh, is that him over there? You didn't even come to the wedding. What are you doing? I wanted to tell you for some time, but hadn't had a chance. Anna asked if I wanted to stay back then. Well, sure I did. They were my people. Anna you know, was working against me. She wanted him to stay. Besides, there are still lots of bandits to kill them. But the Baron is dead. Now you can lead the people. They know those animals can be beaten. Cannon must be beaten. And now they have to fight for their freedom and take it by their own hand. So that not to give it up ever again, despite any odds. God, look how pretty that looks. Also, you can kind of see where the world is sort of loading it off in the distance. I won't forget this, Artyom. And I hope to one day pay this debt back. It's like a game with zombies chasing you days gone. Okay. Depending on it, I can be into zombie games. I, I can't wait until the new di until Dying Light 2. That one I'm excited for. I don't know if that's this year, though. If it is this year, it's probably late in the year. <laughs> About a bike dude running from or killing someone. <laughs> that's a funny way to describe it. Sounds interesting, though. I, I need to look into it, because I'm always looking for new games to play on stream. So, okay, so Demir is here. That's cool, and he's happy he came. Well, okay. Well, I think that's a pretty good place to leave it. I think I think now, if I want to go to the next chapter, I have to look at the map, right? And if that's the case, yeah, I'll leave it here, and the next time we'll jump straight into the new one. Yeah, right there. So, yeah. For now, we got through the Caspian Sea finally. It took me forever, because I, I just can't stream for as long during the week. So I think I've had like three or four streams during the Caspian. But hopefully tomorrow I can do a nice long stream. If not tomorrow, then Sunday. It, might, it just depends on what I do tomorrow, because I will be going out to see some friends in the morning, so I don't know how long that'll take. But uh, if I don't do it tomorrow, I'll do it Sunday. I might also play Monster Hunter with Penguin. Um, but I will have a long stream of this sometime during this weekend, for sure. But yeah. And you can check it out on YouTube. I, I'll definitely have to do that. I need to do that before it comes out and see what it's like. But yeah, in any case, I need to go and get ready for work and get some food because I'm getting really freaking hungry. But yeah, for now, thank you everybody that came by. I hope you all have a really great day. I hope I get to see you tomorrow, Jago. And if not, you know, maybe on Sunday. But yeah, I hope you have a good day too. Later, man.